This road leads to Harda district in Madhya Pradesh around 150 kilometers from Bhopal. At Bhannas village in Harda district lives 56-year-old Poonam Chand Sirohi. His family has been farming this land for generations and Poonam Chand has seen it all. Failed crop, drought, heavy water logging, unseasonal rainfall and bumper crops. It's this last one that Poonam Chand has a problem with presently. This portion of his land was dedicated to garlic, but a bumper harvest has meant he was in for a shock when he went to market. किसान तो हर जगह पिट रहा है हर जगह मर रहा है जैसे अब की आधा एकड़ में बोया ये तेरा बारह तेरह कट्टी लसन चौदह कट्टी जो भी हुआ छः कुंटल सात कुंटल अब इसकी कंडीशन ये है कि मार्केट में खुला लेने जाओ तो चालीस रुपया पाव दे रहे और किसान बेचने जाता है तो मात्र पच्चीस रुपये तीस रुपये किलो लिल्लामी में खरीदती होती है Poonam Chand's cauliflower crop, which he had planted on another portion of his farm, met with a worse welcome at market. I had taken 28 bucks for 20-20 kilos. I didn't get 60 rupees. I didn't get 60 rupees in Gobi. Did you get 60 rupees in total? No, totally. So what did you get in the mandi? He told me that you keep 60 rupees. It's not just small farmers who are struggling with a bumper harvest. Barely two kilometers away in Alanpur village, 50-year-old Manoj Patel grows tomatoes, capsicum and chilli on over 85% of his 100-acre farm. He says the market prices for these crops are nowhere near break-even. We do the work of the farm. मल्चिंग और ड्रिप पे हम लोग जो खेती करते हैं तार मास पे सब्जी लेते हैं तो उसमें टमाटर और मिर्च में लगभग दो लाख रुपए एकड़ का खर्च आता है और लगभग हमको इस बार लास्ट तक आते आते डेढ़ लाख रुपए एकड़ का तो नुकसान हुआ है सरकार का तो किसी भी प्रकार से सपोर्ट होता ही नहीं है इसमें Potato farmers in West Bengal, Punjab and UP, capsicum farmers in Punjab and red onion farmers in Maharashtra are also hurting. The government has not been blind to this problem. It has put in place a market intervention scheme to protect farmers by stabilizing the market and giving farmers another avenue to sell their crop without having to resort to distress sales. But this, experts say, addresses the problem after it crops up. They advise a mechanism for better planning and early warning systems that can help avoid these situations completely. So there needs to be a centralized intervention. There needs to be better planning. Uh, forecasting is required where uh, awareness about the end use demand is, is brought in into this entire dynamic. And production is planned in a manner that it is not surplus unless we have an opportunity to export our produce. Farmers say that the government's market intervention scheme is restrictive as it usually applies to only a couple of crops and even these schemes are often delayed in both announcements and implementation. Many also complain that there is a shortage of initiatives into the research, study and awareness fronts and that means farmers find it tough to make informed choices like whether they should go with alternative crops, decisions that could help put thousands of rupees in their hands every season. In Harda, Madhya Pradesh, with camera person Bharat Kori, this is Santhya for CNBC TV18.